Exactly. What you really should do when you're spending your skill points is to upgrade your class first, and then um, put one thing on the pistol so that you get the extra um, damage. And what else happens on the pistol? The pistol is kind of good, but mo it depends on really what you're doing. If you have... Um, if you're doing the pistols only um, relic, then you pretty much want to be putting all of your stuff on the pistols like immediately, because obviously that's the only um, thing you're going to be able to use. But um, generally, I would, especially in the multiplayer game, definitely max out your class first and then go with ammo and then armor. Um, if you're not running ammo and armor, then I would recommend going with um, random supplies and... Then it, uh, after that, it just kind of depends on what your know, kind of preferences and what you like. Incendiary's explosives doesn't really matter. Um, I don't. I don't know. I just think that it's best if everyone in the game just all has ammo, just so it's never particularly an issue. But you can do what you want. I'm not. I'm not here to tell you what to do. I'm just here to advise you on the best things to kind of do. And that's not even the best things to kind of do. It's just um, the ways that I would advise playing, and um, that's just down to my preference. So. You can do what you fucking want, love. But it doesn't fucking matter. You know, you can do what you want. It's brilliant. And Extinction, I like it, except that it just lacks that charm. And I really just hope that in um, the future DLCs and maps and hopefully more game modes as well, rather than just Hive Destruction, um, they will implement... Um, you know, like different game modes and some story and some personality, the characters and all different kinds of things. That would be really nice. Um, until that day, I'm satisfied for now. I'm satisfied. It's all right. Uh, pretty much, I've mostly just been playing solo, so I really am interested in getting into more uh, multiplayer games. Um, now, the thing with the weapon specialist is that, annoyingly, I mean, the first upgrade for the weapon specialist, I think, is um, a good thing. Um, but the default thing is 20% more damage, and the maximum thing is 50% more damage, which is very, 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 very a lot. So that's a lot of damage that you're being able to put out, and you definitely should, um, you know, try and go straight for that. And it kind of feels like a waste of points upgrading um, the things in between it, so... If you kind of are inexperienced with the challenges and aren't doing the challenges very well and don't take well to them, then I definitely suggest going with the tank. Um... But, you know, the Weapon Specialist is uh, its a tricky class. It's a fairly selfish kind of class, but it is still kind of good at the same time. I mean, as soon as a Rhino comes along, you kind of want that plus 70% um, percent damage with a Chainsaw and Incendiary Birds. You kind of want that. It's very, you know, it's, it's considerable. So, I haven't even bought a gun yet. It's amazing. I'm going to get the Vepa. Because I like it. I actually like the sound of it. I didn't like it at start. I thought that it was kind of shit in this game. But it's online is pretty good, and in um, this is pretty good. I mean, I thought the ammo was just a problem, but now that I know that the ammo is um, limited to begin with, and then you, know, you max, them out, max out the ammo afterwards, um, that's pretty good. But, uh, gotta kill these Scorpio fucks. And, um,. It's really weird, because when you're doing the barrier hive, you'll notice that it's at like that kind of percent of health, and then the next second you look, it's like completely drained. I don't know how that happens. I really don't. But, um... Yeah, if you just try and just keep your eyes open... ...with scorpions. Mm. And it's something which I'll go into as soon as we move on to the next area. Um, but for now... Uh, let's go with some entertainment. Let's inject some entertainment, and also one more tip uh, you can contribute to destroying this. And it's kind of good just to put a um, propane tank, if you can throw it in the right place and hit it. Um, not like I'm able to, because I'm an idiot. Oh! But, um, entertainment. Uh, let's go with... Uh, oh. Oh, that's, that's upsetting. Uh, but let's go with talking about... Uh... Do you like uh, I like uh, I think it's quite good. Uh, brilliant. Entertainment. I'm not I can't I can't entertain anymore. I'm incapable of it now. Maybe if I just reference like talk about semen and childbirth, maybe that'll that'll spruce things up a little bit. Spruce, Bruce Winstein. Bruce Spring Springsteen. Bruce! 
Come over here and give me a cattle. No. Alright. If Chris was Australian. Hello, mates. Chris here. Fucking hell. That wallaby's got my baby. Yes. Anyway. Um, point in the zombie fact number four. That was actually me. Um, I thought it was actually quite a good impression. Then listening to it back, I was just realising how awful that repression of Rowan actually is. And, um... Rowan, he, he shouts at Wheezy on the PlayStation when he's playing Extinction with her, and I really don't appreciate it. The Irish cunt. Fuck me. It's just, it's just calm down. Calm down, Irish. Jesus. Speaking of Irish, I don't, have I finished the Battlefield 4 campaign? I don't think I have. Or did I? I don't think I did. Pretty sure I should do that. As soon as this game's over, I'm going on that. I forgot that I didn't finish it. Or maybe I have finished it, I'm not sure. I don't know. I want to get back into Battlefield, but obviously everyone's wanting ghosts right now and extinction. I'm, I'm not I'm having extinction. I'm having fun with extinction. Alright. I've got other things going on as well. We've got music stuff happening. Um, the Extinction album, which is which is out now. Definitely is out now by the time this video goes up. It's on iTunes. Uh, we've got many videos about it. Amazing um, album. And... I'm on it. The who? It's great. Um, doing lots of work on that. And Extinction, it um, it's just s slightly upsetting that the there isn't like much of an implied story, which is it's all right. That's fine, but it kind of like tries to make you. F I mean, the story is fairly simple, and that there was Odin strikes, and then there was aliens coming out of the ground. But I'd like there to be some kind of underlying conspiracy type kind of thing. That'd be interesting. But apparently not. Uh, now what you want to do with this is that you want to make sure that you spend most of your money before you pick that thing up. Because, obviously. See, it's like it gives you 2,250 or whatever the fuck it said. So, that box of money can actually like make things go a bit weird because you want to make sure you put down sentry guns and all different kinds of things. Um, but this area, uh, when you get like things spawning in. What happens is, is that sometimes these uh, guys will spawn in right at the beginning and if you don't shoot them they will just go away but if you do shoot them then they will come after you but it's kind of a good and bad situation because you know they provide extra money and extra points so it's not you know that bad. It has a purpose. He doesn't seem to know how to deal with me at the moment. Oh, no, he knows. No, he does. Now he knows. He knows what to do. Now. And he's dead. Is he dead? Dead as well. Well done, self. You're brilliant. That was remarkably, interestingly easy. But okay. It was weird. Don't think it should have been that easy. But anyway. Um, that happens in the first area as well. As soon as you clear the, fir the very first hive, then there can sometimes be a scorpion and a, a hunter right at the beginning, which you should definitely try and shoot and um, get the uh, money off of them. But then in the next area in Zone 3, don't do that. Please don't. That is... It's uh, it's gut-wrenchingly uh, tense when you see a rhino and then someone shoots at it and then everything goes to fucking hell. Because um, money doesn't really... I mean, it does become an issue. I mean, when I do solo games, um, typically when I get to the last hive, it's the lack of money which gets me killed because I need to just put down one extra bag of... Um, ammo or one extra bit of armor or something and you know just to survive and not die and you know that's very important but mostly I don't use the vulture just because I find how you can have two um, I'm not sure what happens at the last upgrade of the vulture but with the sentry guns the automated sentry guns you can have two of them so you can have it so they cover each other so that they don't um, get destroyed by aliens as easily and then you can just um, it's it's a lot simpler Oh, I should have been killing them all pro. I forgot about that. Um, but you should really be scorpion goo. No scorpion man. Stop gooing me with your scorpion jizz. No jizz for you. Coming on. I wonder if there is like alien come. That'd be interesting. Kind of disgusting, but kind of sexy at the same time.